Hey Collective, what's up, what's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z. What is up, everybody? I am checking in with you guys, checking in with the beautiful people here for Cancer Season. I hope all is swell. Please like, subscribe, and share if you like the message and it resonates here. Okay, this is a general read, all signs included, all right? So yeah, this is just a quick intuitive download here, all right, concerning narcissists and priorities here, all right? Um, there's something in the air here, apparently here, okay? Like somebody here is, they're desperate to assert some type of control in your life here, all right? Um, like somebody is desperately trying to make a problem where there is none here, all right? This person needs to fall back here. Okay, they need to fall back. This person does not realize that they are a narcissist here. Okay, hmm. mm -hmm. someone's very thirsty, very thirsty when it comes to asserting control in your life here. Hmm. This person, you know, they have no, this could be someone you, you cut off or you're not communicating with here. Okay. But, like, they are desperately trying to make a problem where there clearly is none here. And somebody, they don't realize that they're see-through here, okay? Um, somebody also has been exposed. This person is not trustworthy here, okay? You can consider this person to be a cheater, a liar, um, a snake, or and or a thief here, okay? And, you know, I don't know. There's, there's something going on here. I'm going to pull some cards. I'm going to get straight into the tarot. Okay, and let's see what's going on here. All right. Mm -hmm. Like, again, it's something going on with priorities here. Like, it's a priority for this person. It's like trying to put a foot in the door here. Okay, but the door, you know, is an opening to your life here. All right. And, you know, I don't know if this person lays awake at night. <laughs> thinking about the fact that they have no control in your life here. They have no say-so here. They don't have any power in your life. And I think they have a problem with that here. Eight of Cups, this could have been someone you walked away from. Yeah, you left them here um, with their shit. Ten of Wands with the Nine of Swords here, okay? This is def could definitely be someone that you walked away from here, all right? They're, they're stressed out, worry, anxiety, despair, grief here. Okay, again, they could lie awake at night here, all right? You could have left this person with their own damn energy here. Okay, that's very heavy. Ten of Wands, Nine of Swords, and the Eight of Cups. You're like, I'm out of there, all right? Mm-hmm. Very interesting. Somebody could be recovering from a night out here. Okay, you could have went out with friends. You could... Um, have a little hangover here. Yeah, the devil with the eight of swords here. Yeah, this was not a good situation with the ten of swords here. You know, somebody was killing you slow. I got eight of swords, nine of swords, ten of swords. You could be dealing with the Gemini. You could be dealing with the Capricorn here, okay? Yeah, but, you know, you got the truth as well. I feel like somebody was draining your energy here. Somebody also had you blinded to a situation here, but you received some clarity some way, somehow. Okay, because you were tapped out in the past. You were completely tapped out. You're ravished. All right. This could have somebody could have even been draining your sexual energy here. But you know, the devil with the eight of swords here. All right. This is the control that somebody had asserted in your life at one point in time here. Okay, they kept you blind to a lot of circumstances here. All right. Yeah, I feel like the Most High God came and rescued you here. That's so why I'm getting here. You could have been dealing with the Taurus as well. All right. Mm -hmm. It's like these narcissists here, they're making themselves sick here. They're even getting like pissed off here. Okay. And again, they can have other things on their plate here when it comes to their health, when it comes to their own foundation here. But I don't know. They, if there's something about a certain control in your life like they, I don't know. They feel like if they can get some type of, you know, I mean, revenue, which I don't see, it could be about money, but if they could get some type of string or cord attached here, 
like it, you know, it would alleviate them of their problems, of their issues here. There's something going on here. Okay. It, it, it's very strange because somebody is, is desperate here. All right. And it's like, you know, you're doing what you got to do here. You're minding your business and they don't realize how see-through they are here. Like somebody could be saying that they could be hiding behind like a false, um, intention here. Okay. They've, they could be saying that they want to come in and do this for this reason here, but they have a hidden agenda here. They have a hidden motive behind why they're doing what they're doing, and they don't realize that you see right through their ass here, okay? And this is the real reason why they're mad, all right? It's very pathetic. Somebody, you know, again, they desperately need to fall back instead of desperately getting into your energy here, all right? You left this person behind here. This could be somebody who wants back in. They want back into your life. Like I was getting a download a couple days ago. Ooh, a spinner. Child, please. And it ended up sideways. I can't with the spirit guy. A tower. I be damn. Child, you left somebody in some mess. The tower just went to spin in here. Okay? Somebody got a vertigo. But wow. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You left somebody here in their own chaotic energy here, okay? They have a lot of burdens. They are stressed out here with this tower energy with the nine of swords here. And you don't give a damn, okay? You dropped those burdens and you walked away here, all right? Child. Somebody had you, tra oh, I'm hearing trained. Damn. Mm -hmm. Good. Somebody could have groomed you here. From a child here, you could be dealing with the family, you could be even dealing with your parents here, but like someone thought they had you tamed here with that with that devil and that eight of swords. Somebody thought that they had you pinned here, okay? And then something came through and you took off with the eight of cups here. And this person has been in a tower ever since here. I don't know what they're going to do with the nine of swords energy here, okay? You could have set off on a new beginning here. Yeah. You could have even took a loss to do so here, all right? You could be dealing with the Libra here, all right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -huh. You could have, I'm feeling the energy here with the Eight of Cups, the Five of Pentacles, and the Full card where it's like, let's say you're at a job that's paying you a lot of money, but it's stressful here, okay? And, you know, it, it's weighing on your mental health, okay, on your emotional health here, okay? Um, and it's like, it's to the point where you're willing to take a pay cut just to get a new beginning, just to get away from toxic energy. That's what I'm getting here. Okay. With the eight of cups, the full card and the five of pentacles here. All right. So, Ooh, could be dealing with the Scorpio male in the background here. Okay. That's hiding something. Okay. Yeah. This, this betrayal. Okay. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah. Oh, child, I'm not going to be here forever. Huh. That, that could be what you told somebody here. Like, I'm not going to be around forever here. Okay, and then somebody took you for granted. And you walked away. Okay? You walked away. Yeah, now somebody's taking some time to reflect here about the decisions that they made. They could have rejected you here. All right? Uh-huh. Yeah, somebody tried to, you know, serve you some betrayal here, okay? Somebody could be thinking about some choices they made in the past, right? Okay, where they, they tried to betray you here, okay? Somebody could even try to put something in your drink here, all right? Um, they're thinking about it here. Uh, again, you could have been dealing with the water sign here, okay? Could be a water sign that has an attachment here, masculine energy. And this person was hiding a lot here, okay? Hiding a death, oh child, yeah, it could be. It could, this person could be hiding something going on with their health. Um, because I have the hermit energy to the death card, I've been seeing these two come up side by side a lot. Something could be going on with somebody's health here, there could be an investigation surrounding a death, surrounding an ending here. Okay, this person could be hiding that here, all right. Mm. Someone def definitely could have put something in your drink here, is what I'm getting here, okay. Yeah, and you rejected it. Okay, this person tried it. And, you know, 
You're definitely following your intuition or your guidance here. You walked away from the situation here. Somebody's taking some time to reflect on how evil they were, I guess, here. Yeah, on the secrets here, on the betrayal with the moon card here. Okay? Uh-huh. Someone was caught casting illusions over the truth here. Uh-huh. But they got exposed. A third-party situation here or some type of celebration here. Okay? Yeah, something's going on with somebody's drinks here. Okay? I don't know if somebody tried to poison you, tried to give you some type of, you know, sedative here. You know, uh-huh. Uh the date drug here. I don't know what was going on here, but they're, they're taking a moment to reflect here over their choices, their decisions here. Ooh, child, what is going on here? Oh, the King of Swords here with the Temperance energy here. Yeah, you could have Archangel Michael here and the truth here. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely had some spiritual guidance here. Okay, yeah. You stood your ground here. Uh -huh. You decided that you don't want to celebrate with somebody here. All right. You know somebody was sinister with the Six of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords here, okay? Somebody could have got paid for some betrayal or they were paying someone to betray you here, all right? But you used your wits about you here, okay? Yeah. And you cut cord strings and attachments, you know, people, places, and things that no longer served you in this Queen of Swords energy here, all right? Mm-hmm. child. I cannot. Let's pull a few from the Alice in Wonderland deck. Okay. Uh 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 uh. Okay. A number 41, forget who you are. Conditioning falls away. Memory no longer defines you here. Okay. So again, I'm getting like you set off on a new journey here. All right. Again, somebody tried to condition condition you or groom you here or tame you here, okay? You could have had to relearn a lot about yourself here, all right? Okay. Yeah, manage to be glad. And number 43, create your own happiness regardless of conditions. And again, conditions, conditioning, all right? Yeah, so you decided to be happy here. I'm also getting an energy where somebody could have grew up in a toxic situation around a lot of turmoil here. And you've decided that that trauma is not going to hold you back. You're not going to let that define who you are. You're not going to let that define your path moving forward here. Okay? That's what I'm getting here. Yeah, shine bright like a candle here. Somebody is definitely reinventing themselves here. Okay? This is beautiful. All right? Somebody could have been dealing with some abuse in the past here. Definitely here if you had a, you know, for some of you guys, this could have been a partner. This could have been a family member here. Okay, this could have even been some toxic ass friends here. All right, because I don't know why somebody was trying to put something in your drink. Okay. Mm -hmm. Somebody could have wanted you to be stuck in some type of trauma here. All right, but you broke away from that here. Somebody's, you know, they're having to deal with their own shit here. Okay, yeah. In the past, there was no victory whatsoever here, so you took action here. Yeah, for a new beginning, eight of wands with the fool card again. All right, yeah, quickly, okay? You seen the writing on the wall here. You had an epiphany, you had an awakening here, and you closed the cycle here, all right? So, last breath. Yeah, three of swords here. Yeah, and the fact that you manage to be glad um, in, in any and every situation here. It brings somebody a lot of pain here, all right? Um, this is someone who, you know, possibly they don't want to heal or they're having a lot of blockages when it comes to healing here with the Three of Swords energy here, all right? You know, you went through this pain. You went through this heartbreak in the past here, Okay. And um, they're still stuck in it. They're still stuck in it. Something's going on with work. And again, like I said, this could be um, in regards to finding a new position here. All right. Somebody surrendered. That's why we saw the five of pentacles with the eight of cups in the full card here. All right. Somebody let it all go. Okay. Um, this could have been a marriage where, you know, you were comfortable when it came to, you know, material 
pleasures here, okay, when it came to finances here. And, you know, you decided that, you know, in order to break away from a toxic energy here, toxic situation here, you know, you know, you didn't have a problem starting all over again here, okay? Yeah. That's what I'm getting. Uh-huh. Yeah. Temperance and the Seven of Swords here. Mm hmm But I'm getting you snuck away here. You could have been dealing with the Sagittarius here. Who was lying here. Okay. Mm hmm Yeah. Somebody wanted you to... This is a trauma bond here with the Two of Cups and the Three of Swords here. Okay. Again, like somebody wanted to keep you here in this connection here. All right. Somebody also wants to be tied to your your success here, okay? You know, any victories that you're having here, they want to be tied to it here, okay? And again, that's that narcissist energy. Like somebody wants to be responsible for any success in your life here. And that's not happening here because you broke free from this, this, um, this person, this situation here, and they don't like that. This is why... They are trying to desperately assert control, okay, in your life here, all right? Somebody wants to be able to say, you know, they're the reason why you're successful here, okay? So, all right, collective, that has been Reed. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.